Yo, what's up? <clears throat> I am completely unaware, for anyone who is curious, because I got that comment about whatever, being in a group that tears people down. And I'm not in any group but the body of Jesus Christ. <laughs> so let's just set that straight. Um, but I, I am born again by the blood of Jesus Christ because I believe that Jesus Christ died for my sins, was buried, and on the third day rose from the dead. So I'm part of the body of Christ. I am in, I have been translated out of the power of darkness into the kingdom of his dear son. Hallelujah. I'm a child of God forever by faith alone in the Lord Jesus Christ. So I'm part of the body of Christ. I'm a child of God. That's what, that's what I identify as. Hallelujah. And that's who I identify with is the Lord Jesus Christ and other born again believers who want a fellowship in, in, in spirit and in truth and encourage each other in truth and encourage each other in Christ, in the gospel, and uh, share Jesus Christ and minister Jesus Christ. So uh, anyways, I have no idea. If there's drama going on on YouTube or anywhere else, I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Um, I have known some stuff in the past, but the last like three months or so, I have absolutely no idea what's going on. This is the Lord's doing. And also, I just have absolutely no interest in knowing. I don't care. Um, so if anyone uh, is going to share what the drama is, I don't care. Um, uh, to be honest, I'll probably just delete the comment. That's no hard feelings. I just don't care and I don't want it on the channel. I want Christ on the channel. I want I want people to be encouraged. I want brothers and sisters to um, build each other up in the faith um, and minister Christ and, and praise the Lord for his finished work on the cross. Hallelujah. Um, so I have absolutely no idea what's going on, if there even is anything going on. When I end my videos, I am not talking about any particular person or set of people because I don't care. What I'm doing is I'm preaching the word, hallelujah, the blood of Jesus Christ that has reconciled everyone to himself. Everyone who believes in the Lord Jesus Christ is reconciled to God by the body of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. So I want to do that. And the word, the word has many strong, uh, many strong points about false teachers and false teaching. So I'm just, I'm just talking about like false teaching and how we need to be like, laser focused on the gospel um, and on, on Jesus Christ. If people get offended by that, sorry, but that ain't me. Um, the cross is offensive. The fact that the, the, the flesh, all the good and the bad, not just the bad, not just the bad stuff, no, the good and the righteous flesh, quote unquote, if you want to call it that, that's condemned too. It'll get offended at the cross. It really will. I know. Oh, do I know? Um, because I was there, <laughs> but the Lord really helped, um, just continue to bring me into his love and into his grace, being rooted in the truth and in love in the Lord Jesus Christ. And that's, that's all I want to do. I want to build brothers and sisters up in the faith and I want to preach the word, man. I want people to be encouraged and know that the Lord has them. They are reconciled by the body of Jesus Christ. They are reconciled by their faith in the blood of Jesus Christ. And there's nothing more that needs to be done other than believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. Why? Because that's what the word says. That's what the word says. And I'm going to put I'm going to put my all my eggs in one basket. <laughs> it's going to be in Jesus Christ in the word and what he has said. Um so uh there wasn't really a point to this video other than just like clarifying. I don't know what's going on. Don't care. Uh I'm going to keep doing what I feel led to do and if people get offended by that, um I'm just preaching the word, man. I'm preaching the word and I'm warning out for false teachers, false prophets, uh, and any legalism that may come into play because man, I've been there and I know that it produces fear, death, condemnation, and wrath, man, because that it's, that's its ministry. Ministry of Moses, 2 Corinthians chapter 3 is, is fear and, and, and condemnation, it's death and condemnation. But that's not what we got anymore. Hallelujah. We have, uh, by the Lord Jesus Christ, we have the ministration of reconciliation of the spirit. Hallelujah. So, brothers and sisters, I, I pray that you are well. I really do. Um, this week has been very difficult for me. Uh, there has been some stuff going on in my personal life, um, just like with family members and things. And um, 
health concerns as well as just en attacks of the enemy and all sorts of crazy stuff. But anyways, God bless everyone. Um, thank you for your prayers and know that you guys are prayed for. And I pray that every one of you um, grows in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. Philippians chapter three, verse like eight through 12 or whatever somewhere around there, that we grow in the knowledge of Jesus Christ, that we count everything else as done, and that the Lord would reveal, would reveal his son to us more and more, and the sufficiency of the blood of Jesus Christ and everything that was accomplished on the cross, man, because he's so good. In Jesus' name, amen. And real quick, man, with all this, again, whatever's going on out there, don't pay attention to it. Who needs to be justified before men? Who needs to who needs honor and praise before men? Who needs to be in a clique? Who needs any of that stuff? Bruh, I'm in the clique. Every born again believer is in the clique. <laughs> if you want to even call it that, it's so dumb. It's just in the body of Jesus Christ, man, we've got so much better to enjoy and to rejoice in and to, that is such, so praiseworthy. Um, and it's all by the glory of God. It's all by his grace. And brothers and sisters, let's look and remember what Jesus Christ has done for us. Ignore the rest of it, man. It's just a bunch of nonsense. I, again, I don't even even know what's going on. This just reminds me of high school. And man, I already dealt with that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure a lot of you already dealt with that, man. I ain't, I ain't about to go back to that and have all this drama and chit chat back and forth. I just don't care. People want to say it. They want to say, I'm going a, I'm to a take my Bible. I'm going to get up and walk away because the Lord's coming with me. Because the Lord goes before me and is behind me and is inside of me. And I am seated in him in the heavenlies. Hallelujah. Far above all this nonsense. Man, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ for everything he has done. It's so much better. So, guys, let's keep our eyes focused on Christ and just block out the rest, man. Keep on, keep on the blinders and uh, mark and avoid anyone who is just doing nonsense. Uh, anything that's not Christ. So, praise the Lord. Uh, I love y'all uh, in Christ. He, he, he's, he loves you so much, man. No matter what's going on, he has got you every step of the way. I promise you. But you don't got to believe me. Believe the word and believe him because he is awesome. He loves you. While we were his enemies, he reconciled us to himself by the body of Jesus Christ. So, I want to preach Christ and Christ crucified. And I want to know nothing among you save Christ and him crucified. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. All right. I pray this message was encouraging. God bless you all. Take care. See ya.